Grammy-winning winning artist Lizzo took the music world by storm, racking up hit after hit, but now she's embroiled in a legal battle over who deserves credit for the song that shot her to stardom. ABC's Marcy Gonzalez is in our L.A. bureau this morning with much more. Marcy, good morning. Hey, Dan, good morning. Yeah, there's been some back and forth over this. Now, it started when a few songwriters posted on Instagram claiming they played a role in creating the song Truth Hurts. Lizzo then filed suit, and now those songwriters are taking their claims to federal court. I put the singing single. This morning, questions about the truth over the creation of this hit Grammy-winning song by Lizzo. Why am I great today? After Lizzo filed her own lawsuit last year, songwriters Justin and Jeremiah Raisin, along with Eves Rothman, now responding, launching a countersuit claiming some of the musical elements of Truth Hurts, as well as these lyrics. I just took a DNA test, turns out I'm 100 percent that were copied from an unreleased song called Healthy, the songwriters created with Lizzo just months earlier. The trio claiming the pop star acted in bad faith in an attempt to deny the songwriters producer credits and royalties. Their attorney writing, we look forward to sharing the sound recordings, videos, photographs and musicology that 100% prove that collaboration. Lizzo denying the songwriters claims, separately admitting that the DNA line in question originated in a tweet from British singer Mina Lioness. Lizzo tweeting, the creator of the tweet is the person I'm sharing my success with, not these men, period. If it goes before a jury, you're not dealing with musical experts, you're not dealing with songwriters, you're not dealing with musicologists, you're dealing with normal people, and they're just gonna let their ears make the decision. Cause I'm coming at you like a dark horse. Last year, Katy Perry was found guilty of plagiarizing a 16 second musical riff from this 2009 song. She's since appealed the judge's ruling. And Robin Thicke and Pharrell Williams were ordered to pay nearly $5 million to the family of Marvin Gaye after Gaye's estate accused the duo of plagiarizing music for the hit song Blurred Lines. Blurred Lines. And back to Truth Hurts, Lizzo says there was no one in the room when she wrote it except her, her producer, and her tears saying the men who filed this countersuit have no right to the 20% ownership of the song they're now seeking. Guys. All right, we will have to watch this one play out in yeah, court. It's a great song either way. Yeah. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.